This issue comes back to one question. Who are we? I'm John Stone Street, and this is The Point. Last week, we talked about the rampant idea that all sexual behavior is genetically determined, and thus justified. Ideas like this one have consequences, and we've discussed those. But keep in mind, ideas have antecedents too. Ideas come from assumptions. The assumption at work here is philosophical naturalism, or the belief that nature is the whole show, as C.S. Lewis put it. What if this is true? Well, Alex Rosenberg is quite up front in his book, The Atheist Guide to Reality. In his words, quote, the physical facts fix all the facts. In other words, only science, like chemistry, biology, and neuroscience can actually explain reality. Of course, science only gives us the what of things, not the ultimate why. So he readily admits that his view of reality means that all of life, including human behavior, thought, and our understanding of ourselves, is ultimately meaningless. Give him credit for being consistent, but it presents a dilemma. If he's right, why should I read his meaningless book? I'm John Stone Street. <laughs>